Hey everyone, welcome back to Hades. Again, we're just finishing up. We're about to do attempt number 60. We're gonna... Oh yeah, I exited out so it doesn't show these. So, Des Violent Pass, got all the aspects. Deserts of the Deez. Report to Poseidon after getting the fish. So, next. The fishes. I did beat... I vanquished extremely... I did this. So, that I just need to seek Poseidon. Alright. Anything else I need to take care of. Just finding all the effects. Alright. Well, play the play the leer. One more time. All right, let's go escape. And let's make sure we run into Poseidon How's first. It going, Skelly? We're just gonna make sure we run to Poseidon first. So who wants Poseidon? Gun? You want Poseidon? All right. I have this. Hmm. I need to get to twelve. Wow. Do I want to face him again? Sure. Sure. Let's just do it again. What's the worst that could happen? A lot of things, honestly. Heroes. Mere mortals. Same as all the rest. Someday you shall visit Elysium and meet some of these heroes and discover that they are quite different than the songs suggest. Alright. Headed over to Elysium right now. Little nephew, why I could have sworn you made it to the surface recently, and yet you're all the way back there again. Must be some sort of terrible monstrosity preventing your way out. Alright, I think it's called Cerebrus. Um, actually, Tempest Strike is exactly what I was looking for. But, real fast, um, my friend started calling me Villager Pawn, and I just stuck with it. I also happened to be main villager in Smash. I remember that when you came into my chat the first time, you were talking about how you main villager. Yeah, so that. <laughs> just. Villager Pawn! Ah! Well, as long as you enjoy the nickname, no issue with it. Let's see, money. I mean, it's 200 gold. That's enough to buy a heart and then have money left over. So let's go for it. Welcome to Erebus. I mean, this isn't my first time here, but thanks for the welcoming. Gotta be careful because of if I take a single point of damage... I lose the gold. I lose er I lose the rewards entirely. Yes. So you get double rewards, but you lose them entirely if you get hit there. Stop hiding. Once I get to a boon, it will pause the timer so I could talk more freely. But right now, I just need to focus. Alright, where are they? There it is. Go. Hammer. Always. Always love hammer. Um, it happens to be perfect for my two favorite games of all time. The Villager Pond name. That's pretty nice. Here. So in case you, I don't think you've seen me play this much. Um, this weapon I'm using is a gun. I use, have a special boon where the first shot out of the gun deals more damage than the rest, which is why I keep reloading. Um, so you never have to reload. Is not actually that good for this weapon, but hazard bomb and rocket bomb are both amazing. We're gonna go with rocket bomb. So the reason you keep seeing me reload is yes, because I. Do that, and Rocket is an amazing special. So that little sp special where I have to, um, like, make that huge area and then hope they're in it still, it's replaced with that little, that ex massive explosion. So, way better. All right, shop, you got anything for me? No, nothing worth buying. All right, Zeus with Poseidon. Sounds good. But yeah, because of my special boon, whenever I slam it into a wall, 
I still wonder what became of her fair daughter. Ran away with mortals there, perhaps. Some of the tales even more preposterous. Don't go believing everything you hear. And do be sensitive about the subject, hmm? Demeter, she's been through quite enough. Oh, you play the game and you're just in a hooey heat? Okay. So just remind me, I will, once I finish it, I will tell you to kind of mute, like, look away because the story stuff goes very far, but... Um... So right now what I'm doing is I'm just trying to... I have the ability to see all of these. I'm trying to get all of the boons. So I need Static Discharge as my last boon from this guy. And the Static Discharge is needing... Yeah, I need Static Discharge from him. So... Special becomes a Lightning Bolt to strike nearby foes. Or cast becomes Chained Lightning. I'm going to go with Electric Shot, I think. I have a lot of this stuff unlocked. All right. All right, cool. So I haven't revealed anything yet, but once we get back to the house, that's what the... Once we get back to the domain once I die, that's where you might want to look away. Uh, you just die a lot. A lot of people die a lot. I'm just trying to figure out which of these two I'm going to grab. Oh, I know. Um, oh, wait, no, I... Let's go with Thunder Flourish, I think. Thunder and Lightning. I need a cast for my rocket, basically. Am I interrupting something? I mean, I'm working on my game on the side, so I'm less likely to pay attention if I focus on that. Like Alright, which one am I less scared of? Poseidon. Oh, Stack Discharge, that's exactly why I need it. Awesome. Betrayal, little Hades. Of all my nephews, you should know better than this. Or perhaps I should. One of us, at least. Alright. Damned either way, I guess. Now he's angry. We go. Took a little damage though. <laughs> My fits of anger come and go just like the tides, nephew. Now take this from me and get out of here. I'm currently trying to focus on Gate Bear gameplay wise, but it's way more accessible than Rogue Legacy 2. Yep. Not surprised. Alright. So let's just see what I need here. So I have his legendaries. So I need Curse of Drowdy, which involves Floodshot. So basically we need Aras and Demeter to be our last two for us to get what we need. And I need Flood Shot as my cast. Alright. Grab the heart or grab chaos. We are at chamber 9, so I'm not going to grab chaos because we're about to do a boss. Um... Alright. Flood Shot. I have Flood Shot. That's a AoE. Cool enough. Game's going well. Show me Nothing worth off. buying here. Ooh, maybe the trove tracker? Nah. We want to make. We have. Um... Alright, unfortunately Artemis is not one of the two I need. So I have to skip that boon out. Alright, got perfect catch, that's good on us. 
All right. May stop working on my game for a bit to play Hades. I got a heavy feed lifted off my shoulders. Tutorial, the tutorial took you a bit. Yep, definitely those big problem, those big projects are the big ones. All right. I will say this though: you're one of the few to figure out the origin of my nickname. It is my nick nickname in almost every dick scored? Hmm. Good to know. Good to know. I someone else did that with like they had a name called Agrajack, and I was the only one to realize the connection to Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Alright, ours is one that I could have given him that of your uncle Lord Poseidon might have helped you to this point. But here, my gift shall see you further still. Alright, which of the two do I need from Ares? Alright, so we have Curse of Drowning as the last one for him. And we need either Ares Aid, Curse of Agony, Curse of Blade, or Blade Dash. Alright. Wait, Blade Dash counts? Just want to make sure. Blade dash counts. Alright. Blade dash counts. Awesome. Whew. It's my nickname. Yep. Alright. Uh, ready, sisters. I only have four not minutes left. Blood. Try as I might, I still have not forgiven you for beating me last time. Call it a crippling character flaw. I don't know. That's okay. Forgiveness can take time, but self-reflection is a healthy step. We're making progress. Yep. You think we're making progress? Here? <laughs> oh, you piece of trash. I'll show you progress. Well, you had to try to make that work, so that shows that... <clears throat> it takes you a while to figure that out. Oh, I... So I'm going to... You subfeeded this that I don't think you got to yet. So... comes. Use that. Bam! Whew. Sorry if I revealed some stuff. But... That's better. No need for concern. I stay here willingly. As I previously stated, you don't spoil me. I spoil myself. Yep. Just if I could avoid it to the best of my possibility, I'd like to. But... Skipped her last phase. That felt good. All right. So the last one we need is Demeter. Don't so let's that. grab Demeter. Let's see here. All set. Nothing worth grabbing here. Let's save up the gold. Man, we're just gonna be no, buying good, like some insane themes at the end. Oh, you have the Meg companion. Awesome. Hey, you just spoiled me, you jerk. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. Be there soon, so I actually don't have the Meg companion, but um, I do know it exists because I've seen that in speed runs. It's okay, man. It's okay. <laughs> Gems or purple? I'm gonna go gems since we have so much gold. Just make it even more. Or Hermes. 
I think we go with Hermes. I like having a cast or a special go faster. Like, Hermes always has good boons to help support good benefits. Like, already good boons. Which I already have in my mind. Taking a lot of unnecessary damage. Ooh. You ever wonder how I got this fast, cuz? Lots of practicing, I'll tell you that. And being born unnaturally quick, I guess. Alright, attack is faster, dashboard time to the rope. Side hustle this early is good. God speed. Alright. Demeter boon. Let's go for that. Over the risk with Yara's boon. Alright, definitely a dangerous room. It's me, witches. Hey, Boldy. And here. Oh! They're already dead, so it's just this one guy over here. Or two. Alright. Here we go, Demeter. Zagreus, not to make attempts to grow much closer with me thus. I'm much your elder, after all, and you're my little sprout. What say we keep it that way, hmm? All right, that's fine. Joel Confusion, I need Frost Strike, Frost Flourish, Mistral Dash, or so one of the cool, cool effects that isn't here. All right, so we got to reroll. Any other blessings, maybe? Demeter's Aid is one of them, I believe. Just guarantee it before I take it. Demeter's Aid is one of them. Alright, there we are. That's an aid I can get behind, too, so that's good. Whew. Um, what is the lasting consequence? So I have um a theme. One of the... I've been playing in Hell Mode. So, one of the effects is that, um, it's like one of the heat effects, um, that I gain less health whenever I would gain health. And so it's just reminding me, hey, this much health is what you're getting because of the lasting consequence of that, um, this heat effect you chose. So that's what I is, it's just telling you what that is. Oh yeah, I have a call now. All right, more attack damage. Sounds good. Gems are key. Always like keys for the rerolls. So I just need auras, and yeah, I just basically any Set. god has a chance of giving me a um. How would I say it? Any god has a chance of giving me a duo boom that is fortune told, or foretold by the gods. There we go. Whew. But yeah, so, because I said it real fast, the lasting consequence is whatever I gain health, I gain less health. It's one of the heat effects, because I think I said that a little weirdly. Got one. Okay, glass lava bug. Fish for me. Poseidon has a chance of giving me. And yeah, just want to make sure I have everything I need for him to give it. Yep. So I'm just gonna roll looking for it, unless I have something that's really good. Not what I need right now. All right. So it's either razor shoals or roll again. I'm gonna roll again. Keep looking for that too. All right. Boots with knockwave effects deal bow stabs to bosses. Sure. Since we're going to be doing some boss fight, dude. see God's might. Alright. Which one do I want to put? We're going to make stack discharge stronger. Because we're going to have a theme where the jolted effect doesn't... Uh. Well, look at you, Lurny.
Alright, well, he's already done with that phase. Come on. Oh, he's already at his previous game. Come on, you flying bastard. Bondi, we got you, Highness. I thought that was at the ultimate effect already. Alright, well, it doesn't seem like I've gained ultimate effect, so... Whew. Oh, how do you trigger this boss arena? So, um... So this is kind of a reveal, but... Um, in the extreme measures, one of the possible extreme measures is... Um, more... Basically, one of the increased heats is more dangerous, um, boss fights. And this is the more dangerous version of the Hydra boss fight. So, that's what this run is. Fair warning, you're about to see Theseus's for the next one as well. But yeah, that's how you get to them. Um, but yeah, the reason they do this in speedruns, they choose the harder fights, is because it allows the Hydras to group up more. Which, you know, then leads to you wrecking them more. Alright. We're about to face Theseus again. What do I want to use as a protective measure? You know what? Hold up. We're actually gonna just max out Bone Hourglass. Let's get this thing maxed out. That means I should have bought the Lamias later. There we go. That. Onward. So we have those for 10 encounters. I could have had the Lamias eye for 7, but we made some mistakes. Oh well. Let's finish off with this bone hourglass and make it strong. Heart or coin? We want heart. Because I always like to have 200 health with all my characters, so... When I have less than 200 health, I usually prioritize healing items like... The hearts. Or max health items. Not healing, technically. I didn't even realize I killed this one. Ah, come on. There we are. Let's make sure there's nothing else that I missed. Alright, Hermes not interested. Hammer! Always get the hammer. Okay, what's our challenge? Deck deals 40 base damage, but you have minus 6. First target by special move slower? Mm. So I could go with Delta Chamber just for when I need to use that. Um, I like it better than Spread Fire right now. So yeah, we'll go with De Delta Chamber. Not the best for this aspect, but it's a good one. So... Sharon's shot because we have so much money. And we need boons. Don't care who it is. Ah, little sprout. I was just notifying Lord Poseidon here that all of his domain exists because it pleases me. Remember, my good foster brother. I could freeze your ocean solid if I chose. 
Excellently stated, venerable goddess Demeter. I'm reminded once more of your vast experience, though I think we all prefer our ocean's liquidy. Isn't that right, nephew? Oh, he's actually scared of her. Good to know. Yes. All right, well, well, Blizzard Shot was what was hinting at. Cold Future is what I'm here for. All right. Oh, that's brisk. All right. That means I have to beat her to a boon, so don't even worry about that anymore. Hey, buddy. Couldn't help but hear the rattling of battle chariots of late, raucous laughter and the like. You've really riled up the locals this time, stranger. Must be Theseus and his fancy Macedonian. So he's been joyriding about in that thing, showing it off. <laughs> Your arrivals are becoming a bit of an event, I'd say. And yes, the champion and his bullfriend are likely at the center of it. You'll have to forgive me that I've no intent on attending your contests, but, well, here. All right, so while time is paused, I am gonna check. So that makes Joel duration just 10 seconds flat. That's good to know. All right, and they deal 117 damage each. So that's pretty awesome. So we don't need Kiss of Sticks for the next five chambers. Okay, so these don't scale but we're gonna go cyclops jerky select so. hopefully get it all the way to the boss we're grabbing the aras boon because we need poseidon aras still tell me short one where is your own armored suit i would prefer not to do battle against one who's ill-equipped so i like asterius asterius is my favorite boss to face you know, my father keeps the dress code very strict down there in Tartarus. No armor in the house. Never tried the stuff. Anyways, you have the boons. You're dress fine. Dress code. I too follow a code. And it's a code that strictly states I cannot let you pass without a fight. Mm. Alright. Whew. But yeah, this is the harder version of this boss. And it's freaking scary. Because look at that damage. Come on, hit a wall. Stop chasing me. I'm just doing that to try to slow him down slightly. All right. Oh, there's the scary attack. There. Okay. Whew. Also, we're doing really good on time. All right. So since we found ours, let's quickly spend the proper resource. Hello, Lord Ares. I offer you this ambrosia in your name and honor, Lord Ares. To the god of war. How many foes have I vanquished with your aid and guidance? But more than that, I am pleased to know you and to be your cousin. Ah, such an exquisite gift this is indeed. Yet the destruction you have sown, the sheer carnage. Nothing can surpass that, I should think. Should you ever go to war, my kin? Genuinely go to war, I mean. Do look me up. I imagine I would take your side. That sounds good. In the name of Hades. All right. I just make sure I have everything I need for this last curse of drowning. All right. I have all I need, so let's reroll then. I would like none of these. Nope. Last longer I pull people in, I'd rather just deal more damage than focus on blade rifts for this build. All right. So I need Poseidon and Ares. I keep taking the damage I shouldn't be taking. Oh well.
regenerating. There we go. Two. Definitely took too much damage, though. Sea Storm, when you knock foes away, they are struck by lightning. Oh my gosh, I got another duo boon, even though I wasn't duo trying power. for it. That's a good duo boon. That's a good duo boon. Wait. Is that three knockbacks? Because it's three... Yeah, that's three lightning strikes. Oh my gosh, that just means my attacks deal plus 50 damage. That's insane. Healing whenever possible. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Really needed that. Alright, still need the Aries. Curse of Drive. Fludge up because a pulse that deals damage to foes around you. Yep. There we are. Whew. Well, I think we got it, man. We have three duo boons that all work well together. And be crushed beneath the raging wheelwork of the Macedonian Tau Lambda once again. Yeah. With all these duo boons, you're not as scary. You were kind of scary, but you're not as scary anymore. Theseus, you do know you look even more ridiculous than normal wearing that mask. I get the chariot and the unsporting weaponry, but why wear that thing? Bah, this blessed mask was crafted by great Daedalus himself. A work of art and my entitled claim as champion. What has he ever done for you? I mean, he gives me these hammers. That's not what I meant to do. That's okay. Got out the pulsing effect. Honestly, that means I need to get rid of that duo boom because I don't face at close enough range. For me to make find that useful. Yep. Didn't, not surprised I lost that fight there. Easy enough. Not lose another one, that's all I need to do. There we go. Alright. That ought to make Theseus shut it for a bit. Thank you for your support, my shade. Good shade, good shade. Surprised no one else wants to go on the winning team. Let's first. Knight Spindle's always nice. Let's buy that, I guess. Re use a reroll here. Choices. And let's get Death Defiance. Awesome, you got the tutorial beats just right. That's awesome, man. That's awesome. And we're actually going to. Ooh, ooh. Not the one I wanted. Alright. 
But yeah, I need to get rid of the Arya's Poseidon dude. Does not, the, that duo is worth a lot of money and doesn't work for my build, so. Oof. The Temple of Sticks. Oof. Another Arya's boon to replace it. Oh, I need to seek out Poseidon. Poseidon is not here, though. Unfortunate. Alright. I think we go with the Zeus boon. And then we go for the heart. Yeah, this... This cast just does not work for this weapon. I mean, it worked there, but not every fight's going to be this close quarters. Bone Hourglass ranked up. Thank goodness. And yeah, against Hades himself, I'm definitely going to want the old, the flood shot. Time to deal with Father's pest problem, I guess. Alright, where's the... There it is. Yep, now that we're there. Oh my gosh. Kelly, you do end this. Here we go. The Satyrs must be fashioning those things. Dashing. Your line will flex deal damage at a larger area. Sure, we'll go with high voltage. Oop, fish. Where? There. Oh my gosh. I was so... I psyched myself out. Alright, well, here's my theme. I think we are going to be actually, um find the um, diamond this time, so let's act, let's take decisions like that's the case. So I'm going to save my health so I can buy the diamond. Crazy damage if I corner a boss or a enemy. Come on, die! Oof. myself not dead is appreciated. Pulling it off. Yeah, I think with three death defies and this build, I can definitely beat Hades. So... Whew, just need to not die on the way. Would like to see a shop or a cell, one or the other, really. A 
There we are. Power of All right. Blood shot increased or stack discharge increased. I think you get to the boss. The stack discharge is going to deal more damage. Oh, what is this stuff? All right. But we're assuming we're going to be able to buy the diamond. So get out of here. Let's grab ours as boon, and if we need to, we'll buy the gold as well. Go. Can't really approach because of all the poison. Yeah. Don't really like this cast. This cast I definitely dislike. If I could just sell this dual boon, I'd be in a much better sh spot. Well, in absence of selling the dual boon, let's get. Shot. No way. Get some health. All right. Oh no no no! I need to save the gold. What am I doing? Oh my gosh, I just realized I need to use my calls as well. I never use my calls. Uh, I don't ever use them at a time of the manner, at least. Just more damage. Sounds good. Let's think about Wasn't this. offered. Wasn't offered. I think we actually sell the blade dash to get ourselves that. closer to the goal. Hmm. Need a thousand. Which tunnel? Need a thousand. Keep moving. Hmm. So if you could corner someone to a wall with this, it's insane. The problem is. I'm not going to be cornering Hades into the wall. Alright. That's enough gold. More status. Boldy fixed, taken care of. We get to buy a diamond. Pleasure doing business. Alright, after you take damage. I think that's gonna do the most damage, so. Delicious. 
All right, this is just raw plus. Let's see, six percent damage to boss to the boss. All right. I mean, it's not exactly, but it's close enough to that. Oh, it looks like we have that weird boon, unfortunately. Oh well. Here we go. Let's face the boss. I think I got this. I should get this. Hate to keep you from your parchment work. You've slipped by Cerberus again, I see. Then draw your weapon, boy. Hmm. Should be known that no one else is going to be able to get set past service so easily. I still have two death defies, so I'm basically healthy. Nothing to you. Yep. See you at home. And I even have nearly ten minutes to spare. That's impressive. By my father's name. All right. So that's a current streak of nine runs in a row. All right. Oof. All right. So fair warning. If you stay for this point, I'm about to spoil you on some story stuff. So, just fair warning, Kraken style. So, if you need to just mute me for a bit, that's all correct. I'll be back in like ten minutes. Maybe five. Uh, five minutes, I'll say that. Speak no more of it for now. All right. Oof. Please, everybody, hold your applause. As always next time, isn't there? Congrats. It was my duty to prevent him from getting farther. If I succeeded, he never would have found you. So this once, I'm glad I failed. I hope you know that, my queen. I hoped, but did not know for certain till I heard from you just now, Overseer Megara. And if I may, I understand you have achieved an awful lot since I took my, um... 
leave of absence from this house. I see why Nix and Hades put their trust in you. Thank you, my queen. Then if there's anything else that I can do to help you reacclimate yourself, I'm always at your service. You are most welcome here. It's been a while since I've seen her smile like that. Likewise, you be sure to let me know if my son there happens to make more trouble for you than you welcome in your life. All right? <laughs> As you say. You've taken more advantage of the pact of punishment than I would have expected, boy. I almost wish to commend you for doing such a thing. Almost. I've been rampaging through the worst your realm has to offer, causing you untold inconvenience and likely a fortune in repair costs. I thought you'd be upset. Upset? Heavens no. Through your repeated bumbling, you have revealed a number of shortcomings in our operations, which my underlings are busy working to address. You know you sound especially despicable when you say underlings, don't you? <laughs> don't let me keep you any longer, boy. Go forth. Try to escape again. You're helping make the underworld a better place. How does the extreme measures actually increase that? Treatment. You're my good boy, yes you are. Also, how does removing the extreme measures affect that? Those are two questions worth asking that I cannot answer. Each savage maw of Cerberus salivates in anticipation of the next time to feed. God, I know my dog's like that. The uh. fallen warrior in Elysium <clears throat> I spoke of. He seems like a good man, though. You may wish... Greg, so I'll start your way for a bit. You may wish to leave. We're about to do some big story stuff, so... If you come back in, like, three minutes, that'd be great. No, lad. I was that sort, I think. But he was not. He was... One of the only men I knew who did not look upon me as a threat. He saw something in me I never knew was there. And in turn, with him, I felt... How to describe it? Calm. Whole. <laughs> I'm restless all the time. I can only imagine. He had this wry humor about him. Like he was wise beyond his years. A quality I trust shall see him through his struggles now. Although, I hoped residing in Elysium would mean he wouldn't have to struggle any longer. He shouldn't, sir. And neither should you. Right. Let's drop my fish off. Here, you can have these, chef. I've had more. Mm. Totally worth it's it. It's okay. That is worth. I'll take the special, please. I'll I purchase this another time. You. Nix, you've known Megara practically forever. Well, before my time, at least. So could you tell me more about what she was like back then? I am pleased to see the two of you on better terms of late. Megara always was as she appears. Dutiful and quite particular. Thoughtful and dependable. Respectful. Respectful. Definitely. Alright. Hey, Orpheus. I got myself a liar Ooh, much like you. Here's some good lore stuff. I'm absolutely miserable when I try to play. Got any advice? Oh, why, that's splendid, Zagreus. And I can certainly show you a thing or two. First, the proper posture is important. Here. Now remember to practice the plucking technique which I taught you, and mind your offhand constantly. And above all, continue practicing. The joyfulness is in the practicing itself. Thanks for the impromptu lesson, mate. Hey, Orpheus, you know I once wrested this bottle of ambrosia from the champions of Elysium, defeating them two against one, just so I could bring it here to you personally. Heck yes. Please, my friend. I feel I am undeserving of such a relentless show of kindness on your part. I shall accept, but you'll relent, won't you? As well as forgive me. Mate, if that is your wish, then it will be my pleasure to oblige. Though may this gift symbolize the strength of our friendship for an eternity to come. I've learned so much from you. Thank you, my friend. Would that I had capacity to take some joy from this. Ah, awesome. All right, you can watch Cracket Style. I got away from all the other prophecy fulfilled stuff. Um. Oh, Dire Snake Stone. That's the one I never found. Okay. Was this lot the best you have, Father? Still need to do that. What am I missing? All right, so just now I need to train and practice how to play the Lear. So every time I come back, 
play the leader. It's unplayable in its current state. And then we'll take care of it from there. Won't budge. And we now have our 60 attempts. 